The morning of July 14th was quiet in the equity markets. But Apple stock saw its price move with much more purpose, up 2% by noon. Fueling the strong rally that has been forming since the start of June was a barrage of positive research notes from Wall Street analysts. Citi maintained a price target of only $170 per share, but increased its fiscal third quarter and full year earnings estimate. Driving the revision were several products, from smartphones to wearables and even AirTags, underscoring the importance of the entire ecosystem. Worth noting, consensus EPS for the current year continues to rise. It has increased by 16% compared to 90 days ago, at a similar pace to stock price increase, which effectively keeps valuation multiples stable. Other analysts chimed in on Wednesday as well. Wedbush re-emphasized Apple as a top large-cap stock on the back of the upcoming iPhone 13 cycle. JP Morgan believes that the iPhone 13 demand has been underappreciated and understated, which could be a source of further share price upside in the second half of the year. I believe that the bullish views make sense, and that they are generally aligned with data and information that the Apple Maven has come across lately. Fundamentally, Apple seems to be in a great place. It does concern me a bit, however, that Wall Street enthusiasm seems to be gathering speed after the stock rallied 20% since the start of June alone. History tells us that the higher the stock climbs, the less likely it is to produce superior returns in the following year.